welcome to my new blog post blog post 33 in this blog post i'm going to discuss about enterprise and environmental factors which are actually internal to the organization so let's start so basically uh, eefs actually vary widely in type of nature with respect to internal uh, to the organization and they are organizational culture structure and governors uh, for example uh, including the vision mission beliefs cultural norms values leadership style hierarchy and authority relationships uh, organizational styles ethics and code of conduct then comes geographic distribution of facilities and resources uh, for example factory locations virtual teams shared systems and cloud computing then comes the infrastructure and for example existing facilities equipment organizational telecommunication channels information technology hardware availability and capacity then you can also include information technology software for example scheduling software tools uh, configuration management systems uh, web interface interfaces to other online automated systems and work authorization systems then comes the resource availability which example includes contracting and purchasing constraints uh, approved providers and sub subcontractors and collaboration agreements then comes the employee capability example include existing human resources expertise skills competencies and specialized knowledge so it is time for our star question a project manager is working on a building a dam uh, he needs to recruit team across the nation like engineers logistics person software operators etc he checks the existing force availability and capability this is actually an example of what infrastructure information technology software resource availability or employee capability so the answer actually lies in this video so please do not forget to uh, answer the question in comment section of this video